Hey guys, welcome to Unbounce Hacks. I hope you are doing well. This is me, Sahar Jyot again, and in this video, we'll be using the dynamic text replacement feature in Unbounce. The good thing is you don't need any coding for this, and it's just a matter of seconds when you will be able to use this feature in your Unbounce landing pages. The important thing to remember is that this feature is only available in the pro plans so you want to make sure if you really want to use this feature then you will have to upgrade to the pro plan so let's get started i have already created this page in unbounce and i have just taken a text to text element and i have just added this random text just so you know uh, that this is the thing that will need to really use the dynamic text replacement feature in the unbounce i hope you guys already know about the url parameters but if you don't know then let me explain that to you so if you have your landing page then you will probably see uh, your domain name and then this is the page url that you will always get so a url parameter will always be added after a question mark at the end and then they are going to be the parameters that can be used to transfer the information from one page to another or they are used to track you know the sources from where the traffic is coming you will always see that so for example if i'll just go to google check uh, the amazon shoes i'm just taking taking anything random so this is the url of this product and you will see there is a question mark at the end so here you see this is a question mark and this is these are the parameters so this parameter is sending that the campaign is coming the tag that's been used is google shop desktop and so 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 this this much information they are getting from you whenever you click on an ad or whenever you click on an email uh, that you get so this is really important information for them to track how their campaigns are working and which campaign is working well so in our case if we really want to use this dynamic text replacement feature this could be used in your email list where if you are sending an email to someone and you want them to click on it and when they click on it and land on your landing page you can personalize this text so they will feel this page is more personalized to them and if you have any sort of offer they will probably think that it is especially customized for them and it's not just a random offer that you are giving right so the this is the normal text that i have put in the unbounce page and when the page is published you will see the normal text but when we set up the dynamic text thing then you will see how it works so let's set it up now we'll have to see what is the text that we really want to update so in this case i want to update there this is the default text if there is no parameter received then, uh, then you will see there on the page you will not see anything else you will see this text so let's set it up now once you have selected this text you will go to action so here you can see the dynamic text option click on that you can see it says default text there so uh, this will be the default text if there is no parameter so the url parameter is the thing that will contain the value of uh, you know the thing that you want to update so i'll keep the first name over there this is the parameter name so this parameter will have a value that will be updated in the page right so we'll save this as the dynamic text and if there is only one thing you want to update then it's good but if you want another thing to be updated uh, with some other stuff that you will be sending so you can select the another text you can again go to action you can again click on dynamic text you see this will be the default text for this one you can uh, you can say your parameter profession right say the you will see a blue border around it like here you see blue border so that means they are uh, you know set up as the dynamic text now so um, we'll save this page we'll republish it
All right, so we're good. Let's see if it's working now. You see, as you can see in this URL, we are not using any parameters. So you will see the default text that we have in this page. But once you add a parameter after that, so I'll just append it with first name. This is a parameter that we updated in the unbounce page is equal to there should, shouldn't be any space they, if you should use the hyphen or you should use the underscore always there shouldn't be any space in it we use first name sahib you can see now the hello it says hello sahib so if you are sending this to someone in your email list so anybody who will open it will see their name on the page so it's dynamically like you know this page is dynamically updated for over 50,000 people if you are sending this email the same email to 50,000 people so you don't need different pages but you can just use one page for 50,000 people and that's a great thing and another thing is whenever you want to use another parameter if you have two parameters to update in the url the second parameter will always be added with an and so this is emerson sign you will use that and then you add the second parameter which we used was profession and i will update it as businessman businessman so you can see this freelancer parameter is updated with the businessman now so i used two parameters in this and you see the text was updated and you can do this for n number of times in your landing page so there is no restrictions over that and remember that if you don't have any parameters then you will always see the default text over here right so you want to make sure you use something that's general if they uh, if you're not sending any parameters with your url so you are, want to make sure that uh, it's not something random but it's general for all the traffic that you'll be getting on your page right i hope that helps I'll be creating a separate video to explain how these uh, URL parameters work. And I hope you like this video. Please like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you soon. Thank you, guys.